Good evening and welcome to Alcor. Welcome to the Albite Stadium, the venue for this one. I'm Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Wales against England. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. A look at the starters for Wales. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford is the keeper. Luke Shaw starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Jordan Henderson starts alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the focal point in attack today, Harry Kane. And the contest begins. Jude Bellingham here's Luke Shaw now Harry Kane not a bad pass it was it's been such a long wait for Welsh fans 1958 the last time they were involved in the World Cup here they are again a big moment here Derek wonderful block Davis and Padu. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Can he put it in? And a goal! 1 0. And what a fast start they've made to this game. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. And England get us moving again. A quick response required after the setback. Foden. Here's Luke Shaw. Shaw. Bale. He continues his run, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And Ramsey, can he put it away? And searching for his second, but the keeper equal to the task. Well, he's looking really lively, isn't he? Every time he gets the ball, he looks a threat. And over it comes. Not the best clearance. Giving it a try. In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. Can they extend their lead? Can they stop it going in? Not a time for composure on the ball. Bukayo Saka. Declan Rice. Shaw. 
And Kane comes into the move. Good looking attack, this. Henderson. A wild effort it was. And probably the less said about it, the better. On a pass that lacks quality. Dan James. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Walker. In position here to protect the ball. And he takes on the shot. And effectively parried away by the keeper. Well, what a magnificent save that was. It really was top-class goalkeeping. Well, who knows? He might be called upon again. Still some defending to do. And a goal to level this contest. All even. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. One, one. Successfully cut out. Throw in here for Wales. Chance to cross. That's really good and effective physical play. Well, in the end, it was rather straightforward for the goalkeeper, Stuart. Well, he has to do better there. That's a really poor finish. Foden. Bukayo Saka. Walker now. Kane. They could nudge in front. Well, quite simply, not precise enough from that position. Ampadu. Perfect challenge. Foden. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. But mistimed his run. Well, he's got the timing all wrong there. He just needs to bide his time. it superbly to take back possession setting off perhaps a little bit too much here well England have controlled possession as you can see but in terms of creating chances they've been well below their normal standards unless that changes quickly it's going to be a really frustrating day for them well let's see if they can win the ball back and do something with it he read the situation defensively and did his job Declan Rice and that's great work to make sure it didn't go over the line they've given it away Ramsey Davis firing is in the keeper had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. <laughs> Who's going to get on the end of it? 
Well, as a defender, that will suit you down to the ground. Fruitful looking attack. And the keeper throws himself at the ball. He's driven in the corner. The clearance wasn't decisive. And Ramsey. No way through. Declan Rice. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. Well, he hasn't really been able to hit the heights in this game so far, has he, Bukayo Saka? Well, he's almost been a bystander, Derek. You can see from the touch map, he just hasn't received the ball in the areas where he can do damage. That needs to change if they're to win here. So, back underway here, into the second half. Possession lost. Walker. Walker. Henderson. Not high quality defending. on the back of that particular challenge will the referee let the matter rest there and a yellow card it's going to be Stewart yeah the ref's got that right it's a yellow card all day long Now with Bellingham, Harry Kane, and with that, the attack fizzles out. Walker. Possession lost, intercepted. Bale. Now with Bale. And Badu. Not showing good patience. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. This wasn't a very good pass, finally. Declan Rice Henderson has it high quality defending 30 minutes left for play moving into the advanced position Bale Well, the goalkeeper got there in the end. Well, his recovery is brilliant here. So athletic. Well, just take a look at the stats. They've certainly created enough chances to be ahead by now. They really need to start taking one or two of them to press home their advantage. Bale. Options in the centre. A fine block. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the...
the cards. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Jude Bellingham. Nicely timed tackle. 20 minutes to go in this one. Attacking possibilities for England. And let's give credit to the defending. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. Substitution time it is here. And he takes it on! A oh, terrific free kick. And how well the keeper did to parry it. Going for the short one. Henderson. Nico Williams. England a bit sloppy in possession. Gareth Bale and options in the centre Bale and a good looking ball and he was in the right place to intercept Declan Rice touch off the defender so a corner coming up both managers deciding this is the time to change things around both teams going to the bench it's a short one Henderson Rice moving forward effectively Prime tackle there to prevent the chance. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving because it's still close. And the cross smuggled away. And the keeper more than equal to it. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Corner kick played in. Well, really, it had to be further away from the keeper. Sterling. Foden. Henderson has it. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. And that will be the keeper's ball. And the final whistle. Alas, it has gone awry for Wales in this one. Stuart, how would you sum up their performance? 
Well, Derek, it was a hard-fought contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat, and he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was.